Yes. Lola Holland. Let me pour you a little oh, water. You, you gave me a little water there? A little nice. water for you. Nice. Well, that's Vodka or water, <laughs> either way. What, whatever I filled it up with earlier. Hi, welcome to Hammer Down. I'm Jay. And I'm Mike. And it is great to have oh, him back, God. is it not? You know, first show of the new year. I'm so excited. And uh, I'm excited. This is... Uh, this is something else. Yeah, we are live on Cable 14 yeah. and uh, recorded on uh, any podcast stream you that you may in be interested. Still, he's not uh, quite set up yet. You'll have to give, give Jay a sec. He doesn't realize that seven means seven. Uh, I was listening last night to uh, <laughs> driving around uh, to uh, uh, the Donnie uh, Robertson uh, podcast. Uh, for those who enjoy the podcast, he was a guest on our he show. He was once. a guest on yeah. our show. He came straight from a golf course. We talked about a backyard party he had with uh, Burton Cummings, Cummings, his uh, coaching prowess with the Dundas Real McCoys. But uh, the local politics. Just didn't spend enough time on that, but we closed with "You got to come back soon," to which he responded, "No problem." So we got to get him back. Yeah. I, when you listen to the show, watching it, of course, highly entertaining, <laughs> but listening to it is you—you you get a sense. We worked in radio, you and I, for a lot of years. We we put some time in. Yeah. And listen, a yeah. Big well, I want to ask him what you've been doing, man. Two well, weeks. first though, a shout out to Chris May. Oh, sure, right? yeah. Right, who, who subbed for me for a couple of weeks. Thank you, Chris. That was very kind of you. I was curious, did you guys change it to Hammer Down with Jay and May? No. <laughs> yeah, that would have been... No, I, 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 that's I a no-brainer. Like, I don't like bugging the staff, oh, okay. unless it's pressing. Right. If you were going to be gone on your secret mission more than the two weeks, <laughs> I might have uh, suggested <laughs> a few things. A name change. Yeah, yeah. Hammer down with Jay and guest. <laughs> so, so, so cool. And we go way back. Uh, yeah. Obviously, Chris was here well before uh, his uh, time with the Weather Network, but uh, just a real pro with television. It was his comeback to TV since he left the Weather Network a couple of years ago. This oh, was okay. his first time. Jump back in. Stepping in Good for mice to do that. He sits all erect. Well, not me. And he, I think, <laughs> may have uh, dabbed a little something okay, around the eyes. Yeah. And a little I bit don't, of, there's nothing here. No, there is not. <laughs> there's nothing hiding anything here. Can you give us a hint as to what it was you were up to? Uh, I was in training. So I have a, 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 I have a new job, right? I got yeah, a new job last year, but which just, I'm not allowed to reveal no. what that job is. But I was in training to further my career in that job. And it was very intense. And I was telling you earlier that... You know, I'm an, I consider myself an old dude, and, um, and I really honestly believe, you know, they say you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Uh, that's not true. You can, but old dogs don't like learning no. new tricks. That's, that's where the rub comes. So learning, being like literally having homework, Yeah. like I'm like, what am I doing right. with my, what did I, where did I go wrong right. that I'm doing homework? But I got through it. Everything's good. But I, I miss doing the show with you, and uh, I'm glad we're we're back together. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That generation alpha, their uh, their whole future is constantly re-engaging with learning something, and upgrading, upgrading, constant upgrading. upgrades. Yeah. Whereas we are yeah. from a, no. we just missed that generation. Oh no, yeah. If I didn't learn <laughs> it back heavens. then, I ain't so learning. So what, what is it? Is it an attention span thing? Is it an intelligence thing? <laughs> what is it that? What's this old dog thing? So I, what I really think it comes down to, your, your memory just isn't as sharp. You just don't, you're not locking stuff away as much, right? The memory, I always, uh, my, my mother-in-law has, has uh, dementia, has Alzheimer's, sure. right? And, and I, the way I, I explain it to her all the time is the filing cabinet's full. And, and so now she's like, oh, I can't remember. I go, that's because the filing cabinet. you got to go all through the filing cabinet. I really believe that the memory is like that, and my filing cabinet's pretty full. Right, but so there's, now there's there a wanting, lot of files in there that you could probably. You can't, but you can't get. You don't. You don't get to pick what files to get rid. of. I would love to. What get if there's a fire? <laughs> I would, Maybe I, that I would need help. a fire clean out the attic a little bit, hundred <laughs> percent. But I really think that yeah, it's just I learn something. I I, pay, oh, I read it, read it, read it, read it, and then you go, oh, what the hell? What, what the, you know that mm, that yeah. it's like? Why did I walk into this room? <laughs> but but there are parts of having those file cabinets bursting at the seams and, and as many as you can pack in there at your age, which is 59. <laughs> yes, it is. Um, 60 in July. I yeah, overheard yeah. in the hallway today. We yeah. are going to take you golfing. It's a big 6-0. Oh. And I'm going to pay for your cart. <laughs> oh, because at that okay. age, okay. no more walking. No Mike. more walking for uh, a 60-year-old. Uh, when you have it bursting from the seams, you, you, you've you got it all up there. You should be able to call upon it. You wish you could, yes. So try doing crossword puzzles. I, I've just recently, I do the L.A. Times, uh, the New York Times, mini crosswords. <laughs> <laughs> They're so simple. But 
there is no I sit and I think my good boy recall. would never be he just yeah. doesn't live long enough right. to know all those little yeah Ava Gardner no way right uh, but right. I know and and it's actually great because you're recalling you you really are going to that filing cabinet See, and, for and, every word and I hate those kind of I hate those I hate crossword puzzles I hate Wordle I, yeah. I just I just don't enjoy that this is why I come off as more intelligent <laughs> I'm sure I'm, we're gonna need a, we're gonna need a viewer survey oh. on that one <laughs> Mike we, we've uh, we've an old friend tonight yeah 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 I'm sure you were surprised uh, I was surprised, and, I then, and, and uh, but yeah, but I, I got a chance to meet him a couple of times at the radio station years ago. Yeah, we did interviews in with him, yeah, right? Yeah, so Tony, really Tony cool. Schiari is a uh, well-known uh, actor who doesn't just act locally. He's a playwright, he's an artist, he is a philanthropist of sorts, yep. uh, helping people for many, many years as a profession. Uh, did I mention playwright? Yeah. Uh, the filing cabinet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're the, the intelligent There's one. something I'm missing, but we're going to talk to him in just a bit. You'll recognize him right away. Uh, he he spent some time on Degrassi working with uh, with Drake. Yes. I'm curious to know what a young Drake on Degrassi was like to work with. And even more important than that, he's a fun guy. Just oh, he's a, a great fun guy. guy to talk to. And, so and we're my, looking forward to it. Uh, my closeness to him, I think, where we're brethren, is uh, love of Frank Sinatra. Oh, yo, he you both love the Sinatra, do you? knowledge on Frank Sinatra. That's another thing I hate. <laughs> yeah.